the first thing that we can try to do is to find an expression for dv dx. When v is given to us as 1 third pi x squared multiplied by 36 minus x, if we were to just stick to this, we have to apply the product rule. So I think it is better if we were to just expand this in. So it will be 36x squared minus away x to the power 3, which makes dv dx way easier to differentiate going for this expression as compared to this. So now dv dx is going to be equal to 1 over 3 pi. Differentiating this, it is going to be 36 times 2, 72x minus 3x squared. So this is my expression for dv dx, which I can also factorize out 3. That will give me a pi, and if I have to factorize out x also, pi x 24 minus x. And we are trying to look at the rate of change of x dx dt when x is equal to 9. And we do know what is dv dt according to the question water is going to be going in at a constant rate of 18 pi. So here this is 18 pi. Let's try to find the value for dv dx. So substituting 9 into here, we have a pi times 9 of 24 minus 9. This is equal to 135 of pi. So quoting the rate of change equation, we have a dv dt is equal to dv dx multiplied by dx dt. dx dt is what we are supposed to find. dv dt is equal to 18 pi. dv dx is this 135 pi. Then multiply by dx dt, which means that dx dt is going to be equal to 18 pi divided by 135 pi, which will be 2 over 15.